Hey guys, and welcome back to Carrier. When we last left off, we were aboard the Himmel, and we were investigating. Um... Okay, just make sure. We... Yep. Okay, that, that was a bit weird. Controllers were. Oh, that's strange. Yeah, the way the character ch uh, turns is kind of like weird and slow. But apart from that, it seems to be okay. So yes, we was aboard the uh, Himmel, I believe, and. Uh, We've been sent here because this fantabulous cruiser has gone dark for some unknown reason. We've been sent in to check it out and have a bit of a look around. He's already gone. We've been given a keycard. Looks like the body of an officer. The nameplate says Steve Benson. Well, Benson, I don't think you've got anything for us. He's already gone. Okay. So here we are playing as Jack. We've been given our orders, and our orders are clear. They are to search for the medical room and find out what the hell's going on in this place. Unlocked with A3 ID card. All A3 locks have been unlocked. A3 ID is discarded. Okay. Hmm. Medical room. Uh. Uh What happened? What's going on? Hey, are you okay? Yeah, he looks fine. Stop. Don't get any closer. <laughs> Who are you? Are you infected too? Uh. I'm Sergeant Ingalls. I'm part of the Spark team sent to investigate the ship. What are you doing here? Spark? You're a little too late. This is not a human anymore. Here. Take a look with this. Um. What is it? The Beam T3N Scope. Okay. Developed by the uh, TNA for infantry in the case of biological warfare. Can be used to identify non-human life forms. See in the dark and see through some objects. Ooh, nice. Uh. What's going on? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Don't you believe what you This guy's see? cracked up. I am Carrie. <laughs> the ship doctor. <laughs> uh Harry, you're going to have to calm down, buddy. I was finally able to capture one of these these things alive and conduct some experiments, but the ship is already full of them. What? I tried to analyze this one, but it's too late. There is nothing I can right. do. Right. Ark is the cause of everything. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? It, it is all because of Ark. Ark. Who's Ark? Ark? This monster looks like a human, but, but it's not. It's an inferior life form. Inferior. Hey, stop! Are you crazy? <laughs> I'm not crazy. I'm <laughs> perfectly. Yeah, I'm not sure I believe you. And you? <laughs> Are you really a human? Um. You're not. <laughs> Ark. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Try shooting it in the head, dude. Hey, wait, what are you talking about? What's Ark? Look around you. <laughs> you have arrived in hell. I I can't trust anyone anymore. Soon, soon, you too will feel the hopelessness. <laughs> well, that was cryptic. I like the way we didn't give a shit either. It's like, yeah... No shit's given. Oh god. Um, hey, please don't chew my face. Thanks, pal. Can we kill these things? I guess so. It looks like they bleed when they're damaged. <laughs> what the hell was that? 
That was brilliant. I like the way he has a little nibble on the doctor and nobody gives a shit. He's just chewing, um, just having a little chew of uh, Terry's Terry's back of his neck. And, and, you know, all in the day's work, I guess. Nobody cares. I like the way uh, we have some blood effects here. Ooh. Uh, yeah, we'll have it. Empty. Right, so there are objects around that we can search. Nothing useful here. Yeah, Terry's lost his marbles, I think. Um, poor Terry. Is that, does that indicate something we can pick up? I guess so. Record of research. Medical staff. Terry Adams. These names, though. Captain McG McGregor. Oof. Called a meeting to discuss the parasitic outbreak on the ship caused by an explosion in the engine room. The development... Uh, department has suggested that the parasite might in fact be the ancient organism Ark. Uh, okay. I have made several attempts to cure the victims of the parasite, but regardless of what I do, the patients have expired. My efforts have changed from curing the patients to trying to understand what has happened to them. The results of my research are as follows. April 5th, looking at First, at a subject whose skin had turned green, I discovered a yet unknown virus. Perhaps this virus is also the cause of the patient's violent behaviour. April 6th, a member of the crew who came to my office became violent and attacked me without warning. I had to shoot him. After an examination of the body, I discovered he was also infected. In this case, there were no visible signs of infection. What am I to do? I can't tell... The difference, I won't be able to trust anyone. April 7th, I have acquired the new BEM-T3N scope. With it, I can tell the difference between those who are infected and those who are not. Next, I'll capture one and dissect it alive. Oh, fuck. What the? Cheese and biscuits is that? Little parasitic bastards. Let's get out of here. All right, can we kill these things? Um, yeah, yeah I guess we can. Dude, the aiming system's not bad. Right, let's get out of here. So, we have some bullets. Now, how do we use that um, night vision thing? Ah, so we've got the welder, and we've got the... Yeah, so we've got 31 left for that. Okay. All right, let's keep the Glock loaded. Now, how do we use... Ah, right. Okay. Scanning. What are we scanning? Why are we scanning? Can we go into this room and scan stuff? Is that going to tell us... Anything interesting? Oh. Oh, right. Okay. Does that actually do anything? Oh, we can zoom in on it. Kind of looks like a Carrot. A mutant carrot, but a carrot nonetheless. So, okay, we've got a scanner jig. Which is interesting. And we also have a new key. Oh, fuck. Right, what happens if we scan these guys? I guess nothing happens if we scan those guys. Rawr! Come get me, Gur Arg. So, is it headshots? Oh, nice. See his head come apart. Right, not bad. Come on, you fuckers. Oof. Manual reloads are a thing. Are they going to get back up? No, it looks like they've got some sort of parasite like hanging out of their brain. Oof. And that definitely looks like... Ooh. Okay, so if we hold down A and push 
down. We can do like a quick turn type thing. That's cool. So that, okay, it wasn't those guys that got back up. Interesting. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep exploring. Gun at the ready. Oh shit, look at this place. What? The hell is this? Like the place is being terraformed. Everything's covered with plants. Yeah, no shit. You can see that. We've got danger. We drop serious frames. Look at that. 60 FPS. Like 30 FPS. So there is like a V-Sync here. Alright. Not 100% sure what that's doing don't even know if we can hit that right let's get oh god the fuck is going on with that alright well let's not worry about that just yet let's just get a wiggle on out of here alright Jack things are going a little bit uh, south I think my friend Jack do you copy yes I'm checking the aircraft hangars on deck one. What happened to Leonard? Leonard? Well, he... He was attacked and killed by some creature on the flight deck. What? I couldn't get to him in time. I I'm so sorry. No, there's nothing to apologize Yeah, for. fuck Leonard. I was the one who said the flight deck was safe. Colonel. Sorry, this is no time to get uh emotional. We have to concentrate on the mission. Yes, sir. It came down and attacked me, so I killed it. Were there any more on the flight deck? The control panel of the elevator was damaged, so I couldn't go up and check. Until I went below, it was just me and Leonard on the flight deck. I don't know where the creature that attacked Leonard came from. I see. Evacuate any survivors to the flight deck. I don't know if it's safe, but let's hope it's better than below deck. Yes, sir. Do you have any idea what's going on? Earlier in the ship's hospital, I saw a human turn into some sort of monster. I don't know. Here on deck three, they're all over the place. Something really strange has happened here. Conduct your investigation carefully. You should be ready for anything at all huh. times. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, so it's probably not safe, but we're going to send all the survivors up to the top deck anyway. But I suppose if we can get a good group of them together... And anyway, um, the top deck's pretty big, and there was loads of uh, aircraft up there, so it could have been hiding anywhere. I mean, we know. Well, I can hear something. We know that it came from, uh, oh god, underwater. Oh uh, yeah, can you stop doing that to me, please? Oh, can we, like, aim? Oh, we can't aim at its head. Right. I like the way they kind of dissolve into nothing. Now, on the uh, VMU, I can see my health. And if we go into our status screen, we actually have a proper health bar, which is interesting. Save. Oh, fuck. Right. All right, Jack. Light him up. Come on, Jack. No fucking around, boy. Dropped him. And we have no idea how many bullets we have. But you can go through this door. We could really use some more bullets or something. Oh, radio room. Hey, what do you think you're doing? With the dead guy? I'm too late. Heimdall, why did you attack the Spark helicopter? Huh? By order of NTA Central. Activate the intercept system and stop the ship. Heimdall, respond. Repeat. Immediately deactivate the intercept system and stop the ship. This is Sergeant Ingalls from Spark. Spark, you okay? 
Our helicopter was destroyed during an emergency landing. Hey, what the hell is going on? What's going on? Please respond. NTA Central. Damn. Hmm. Well, I like the way we just walked in and tried to talk to a corpse. That was uh, a thing that just had. There's a dead body in the chair. He must have been attacked whilst using the transmitter. Yeah, you think? Damn, our, our friend Tom here is a, is a bit of a Sherlock. Right, well, let's save the game. Like the fact that we can save, and there seems to be plenty of save stations, at least so far. So, happy with that. Mm. See this, uh, Ubisoft? This is a save system. This is a save system that works. Okay. Right. So the same room in the main passageway. Ah. So even when the enemies die, they leave blood splatters behind. That's interesting. Might be worth checking our gun, actually. Seeing how many rounds we have left. Ooh. 1B. Oof. Okay, we're really low on bullets. Um. Who are you? I'm Sergeant Ingle. I'm part of the Spark team sent by NTA. Man, you were lucky to make it this far. Was the intercept system deactivated? No, it destroyed the helicopter we came in on. It's hopeless. It's impossible to leave. Don't give up. We'll deactivate the system somehow. Do you know where it is? Man, it's in the weapons control room on deck six, but uh, it's gonna be hell to get there. Trust me, we'll get there. Evacuate to the flight deck and wait for help from the command center. Hey, we're counting on you, Sarge. This should come in handy in your mission. Yeah. Why, thank you, strange, mysterious man who's just aimlessly wandering around these decks. Map, map data. Ooh. How do we use the map? Can I use my scanner on you? You're safe for now. Okay. How do we use the map? Ah, dude. And we can search the rooms. Ah, oh, this is so cool. Right, okay, well, I mean, we've... We finally have some way of navigating. Medical room is back there, yeah. Cool! We actually have a fucking map. I like it. Yeah, dude, you might want to, like... Get out of here. What are you doing? Are you just following me? Deactivate the intercept system. You gotta go to the weapons control room on deck six. Hey man, be careful. Yeah man, be careful. Mate, you might want to like go up onto the main deck, I'm just saying. Like, it's a little bit sketch down here. Alright, so, got another door here. Let's go through this one. So, deck six. Oof. Ah. Pilot prep room. Hey, what happened? There's something over there. Oh, fuck. Uh. Ah. Uh, what? I don't see anything. Oh, good. Oh, good. Invisible enemies. Yes, thanks, game. What? I can see it. The scope? Yes, the scope. So we have invisible enemies. That's great. 
I'll take care of it. You stay in the locker. Good thing we've got some bullets. I do like the way we can blast bits off these guys. Right, he's done. It's okay. You can come out. Interesting. There's also a lot more survivors on the ship than I thought there would be, which is cool. You're Jack, Bob's <laughs> brother. You know Bob? Jack and Bob. Jesus Christ. You must be Eddie from Bob's outfit. You got it. I'm glad you're okay. Was Bob with you? I lost track of him when the mutants came. Oh. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm glad to see you're okay. It's not safe here. You should go to the flight deck. Okay. Be careful, Sergeant. Thanks. Hurry. Yeah. Yeah, take some, like, guns with you as well. I like the way you can hear them running through the blood. Okay, take some weapons with you, dude. Because you're probably going to need them. Oh, yes. Three pistols magazines. Three? Nice. Happy with that. Hey, what's in this one? It's got to be, like, health or some shit, right? Uh, two level... Oh, how many energy drinks do we have now? Uh, quit. Oh, yeah, we've got to go to use, haven't we? 48, nice. We've got a lot of energy drinks. I don't know how much health that restores, so... I don't really want to play with those just yet. What's this thing? A rack for machine guns. All the guns are gone. Boo. Boo. Oh, we can search. We can search some of these lockers. Okay. Won't open. Won't open. I guess... Really? We're going to have to search every locker one by one? Uh, okay. Wish it was a little bit of... Ah, these two look different colours. Yes. Nothing useful in here. Come on. No, look. Search the other one. The other one that obviously looks like it's going to open. Well, I guess it's not going to open. Possible we miss some stuff here. I think it would take all day to check all these lockers. What about... Do we check that locker? There, yeah, we check that one. All right, any more lockers that we can open? Yeah, we can open that one. Oh, nice. Pistol magazine. I mean, we'll take it. There's no point in not taking it at this point, I guess. Right, anything in these doors? Please? Seriously? One thing? Okay, well, maybe not. All right, well, I mean, we got some stuff, which was nice. If I'd had this back in the day, I think I would have loved it. Oh. Oh, hey, friend. Oh, God. Uh, excuse me. Please stop strangling my brain. And we're now injured, which ain't great. Right. No idea how that went. Let's use... Oh, wow. They actually give us a considerable amount of health. Would have been nice to get a better camera angle. But I guess we can't have... Dude! Really? 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 Alright, that's it. Then. Kind of hard to see whether we're hitting these guys or not, but, you know, that's fairly standard, I suppose. Uh, they're dead. I say they're dead. They're not they're, 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 they don't look like they're bubbling away. Uh, right, so weapons that way. Catapult crew room. Let's go check out the catapult crew room. Man, this game's pretty fun. Yeah, some... Oh. 
Something's breathing. Navigation deck, flight control deck. Yeah, we got zombies. We don't care too much about those zombies. We can't really see them, so we can't really fight them. Let's just keep exploring for now. There's this weird plant stuff everywhere. Ooh. We've got some bodies having a bit of a swing around. I mean, they're having a good time. It's almost as if Predator was here or something. Okay. Where are we now? Back outside? Yeah, I guess so. Ooh. Anti-aircraft battery points into the night sky. Still ready for any approach. Hmm. Can't appear to take these things out anyway. Yeah. Nasty fucking things, them. Right, what about... Can we go up here? We can. Really, dude? Really? You're going to climb that slowly? Yes, you are. Alright, we need to be going to deck six. So, and I'm not sure how much ammo we can hold. Or if there's like a hard limit of equipment, it doesn't appear to be. And there's no mention of it. And I don't mind that. I kind of like Resident Evil's uh, inventory system, and it works for Resident Evil. But sometimes it's nice not to have to worry about those things. I guess we're going to make our way slowly to the bridge. Jack, do you copy? Jack. Sir, this is Jack. Give me a report of your current situation. Sir, I'm on my way yep. to the bridge. The partition for the corridor to deck two is closed. Captain Lang is in the security room trying to open it. And I'm looking for the necessary discs. Got it. It looks like the computer is running wild. <laughs> Who knows what happened there? Uh, but be careful not to get wrapped up in the explosion. You're stored in deck one weapon storage. Roger. Okay, so we can start blowing parts of the ship up. It's kind of good to know. Man, this ship's a maze. As you kind of expect it would be, but bloody hell. So, here we are on the bridge. I don't know, this is the navigation deck. Oof. You got that chap? Body of a crew member. Looks like he's been shot. Oof. And there's another disc there too. Nice. Okay. Ship's log. Uh, 2023 April. I like I like the fact that uh, you know, we're two year uh, three years into the future and floppy discs have made a comeback. James McGregor. April 1st, the hurricane mission was a success. We are now headed back to port. The FNU-036 performance was much better than I expected. Uh, I have received a coded transmission from headquarters. We are requested to take on board the ancient organism ARC, found on the island NC-0023. The reasons for this request are unknown. Okay, so everyone seems to know about this ARC thing. Ark taken on board. Course plotted for the port town of Newhouse. Not to endanger the environment. Uh, not to endanger the environment. Transport of Ark was requested. There was an explosion in the engine room and sections were damaged. We have heard from the information department that there may be a Southern Cross spy on board. But we do not know if the spy is responsible for the explosion. Fortunately, the damage will not affect our progress. Uh, April 5th, one of the sailors assigned to the repair of the engine room mutated and suddenly attacked and killed a fellow crew member. An emergency countermeasure meeting is scheduled for tonight. An emergency! An emergency countermeasure meeting is scheduled for tonight. Yeah, it's fine. We'll deal with it later. <sighs> the number of mutations among the crew is growing at a terrifying rate. Zoe is damaged. We are no longer able to transmit. I fear it will become impossible to return the ship to its original state. April 7th. We have fought the onslaught of the mutations to no avail. 
I have no idea what else we can do here. All I know is that the mutants cannot be allowed to reach land. Yeah. yeah. Well. <sighs> oh. Hello. Dude. Okay, I thought that was like fucking zombie or some shit. You, you, you right there, buddy? Hey, you. Are you? I think human? so. Yeah, I'm Sergeant Ingalls from the Spark Team. You're safe. There's nothing to accomplish here. There's nothing to do but abandon ship. What happened to your face? Calm down. Evacuate to the flight deck. Help is on its way. If you don't leave, they'll kill you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, well, that may be, dude, but, uh... You go and hide on the flight deck. That's probably for the best. You're a strange gentleman. Still raining. Doesn't look like it will stop soon. It's so weird. You just see, like, random enemies. Uh, random NPCs just appear. Ship is on automatic pilot, and the controls will not respond. I guess so is the computer. All right, I thought there might be a little bit something more here than that. Nothing up here at all. Yeah, yeah. Just someone to save. I'm impressed with how many people are still alive here. Yeah, all right, I get it. I get it. He's been shot. He's dead. Cool story. Uh, visibility is good, and the radar is still operating. Well, I mean, that's something. Okay, let's get out of here. I find it interesting that they're just accepting that the, the fact that uh, they had to bring this deadly virus on board. I mean, it's just, yeah, it is what it is, you know. It's cool. It's cool. We're just going to bring this virus on board that's probably going to go mad and kill everybody. Ah, the arc virus. There's a There seems to be a fair amount that the game, I wouldn't say assumes that you should know, but... There's a lot missing here. The arc virus. Stay away from hey. me. Calm down. I'm part of the spark team. Spark team? Yeah, we're evacuating survivors to the flight deck. All right, I'll go there. Do you know a pilot named Bob Ingalls? Bob? He's my brother. I think I've heard the name somewhere, but... Your face. Hmm. You know, maybe if you check the crew list using the terminal here, you'll find something. I see. I'll check it later. Do you know where the weapon storage is? Well, from here, you go back into the ship and go straight. It's beyond partition C. To get in, you'll need an ID card. Here, you take mine. legend! That's more like it. Right, you go hide out on the flight deck. Thanks. A2 ID card. Paint. Nice. All right. Uh, okay, so things are actually highlighted. Things that you can pick up. Level 2 energy drink. Oh, level 2 energy drink. Is it me or does that look like a Mountain Dew? Hmm. Right, well, we're okay for now. So, we can get a new weapon. I guess there are a fair few people we can save. And I don't know if they're all optional or what. Can we check the computer here? Still raining. Doesn't look like it will stop. Well, it will stop, sir. Can't rain forever. List of the crew. Yeah, let's check for Robert. Looks like they're running Windows. Uh, oh, looks like Linux, actually. Which makes sense, to be fair. Monday to Friday, assigned to scramble team. Presently at sea. Deck three. All right. Bob, I hope you're okay. I'm sure he's fine. Yeah, I don't think this is the sort of game that's gonna have you murder your brother in zombie form, but maybe it will, you know? Who knows? I've never played the game before. But there are a good amount of survivors here. So, who knows? Anyway, we're going to have to, like, end it here, guys. Because we've been going for 34 minutes. Um, 
I'm enjoying this. I'm not really sure how this is going to pan out. You know, it's giving me kind of almost like an original Dino Crisis vibe. I don't really know why, but that's just kind of the feeling that I'm getting from the game anyway. So when we come back, I guess we're going to try and slowly make our way to the engine room, I guess. So we haven't checked out the catapult crew room. We haven't checked out the pilot prep. There's the magazine, medical room, security room, catapult control room, briefing room. Ah. So port side elevator. It's not a lot there. We really do. So there's six decks. So we really do need to find some more maps. But uh, I'm sure we shall cover that in the next part. So, hopefully. Thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.